Hi everyone, we have PIDE Master and PIDE Instructor Sohan Parker with his uh, teammate uh, from Dominica. Sohan, how was your experience uh, coaching Team Dominica? Well, it was uh, the first time Dominica played in Olympiad and considering this, uh, we played very well. We were actually in top three of the Group E uh, category. That means there are medals for every category. So we were leading last three rounds, but unfortunately last three rounds we didn't well. I mean, didn't go well. Uh, the team is fantastic. Uh, I mean, all of them are playing for the first time. Uh, and all of them are uh, academically well qualified as well. One is doctor, one is lawyer and all sorts of things, but still they get time to chess. And thanks to Mr. Daniel, who is a delegate of Dominica. And uh, he's the one uh, we were interacting first and uh, he's the one who bring the team together. He went all over to India for the FIDE election and I think he can just have few. Team coaching was very good. Actually, they were very good students. So the main, as you know, chess is more of uh, being a student rather than teaching. So they were very good students. So I had a very easy time and all of them were following. But uh, you can't do much in tournament days, but still I tried my best. Even the team picked up well. We defeated uh, two stronger teams. We drew with two stronger teams. And uh, we were very close to winning two, two games as well. So it was a very good performance. But uh, okay, hopefully we will win the last round and uh, we we'll come back uh, in the Hungary Olympiad stronger. Daniel, how was your experience uh, being the head of delegates for Dominica? It was quite an experience. This is our first Olympiad and our first Congress as well. So as a delegate, I was introduced to many people, many powerful people. And this was the first time seeing the proceedings, how the voting, the elections, the different committees, hearing the different speeches and presentations, reports. It's very insightful and it takes a lot of information back home to Dominica, to government and so on. How is the chess scene in your country? The chess scene in my country previously was very vibrant. However, as players aged and went overseas, the chess scene kind of died down. I saw this and was not satisfied with the situation. So in 2021, I reached out to Fidi and they sent down Grandmaster Nigel Short to Dominica and he helped revive the chess scene here. There. And uh, is this the first time you visited an Olympus? Yes, it's our first Olympia. How did it feel visiting India, so watching so many people at once? This Olympia is going to be very <laughs> tough to beat because the Indians <laughs> did a very wonderful job. This is a fantastic experience. I don't think there's any, going to be any other Olympia as great as this one. And for the first time, Olympia had uh, spectators. So do you think that this is finally becoming a spectator sport? Yes, it is. It's become a spectator sport. It's when it's been broadcasted online, you haven't been seen the spectators in person, but they have been there looking at the games. What do you have to say about it, so much? Well, I mean, the results are there in front of you. You can see a lot of people coming in, and uh, you can see the website is full with classes. I mean, there are, there are many phones, like uh, I cannot get a pass, so that means uh, even the capacity has exceeded. So chess uh, will one day will become the most popular sport in India and soon in the world. Thank you, Sohan and Daniel, for your valuable time. I hope you have a fantastic finish to the 40-foot chess Thank you. Thank you.